Welcome, Wanderers and Missile Mavens, to Travel Small, the channel where even our missiles prefer jet-setting at Mach 27. Today, we're unraveling the Avangard, Russia's cosmic dance partner in the hypersonic realm. Picture this, it's so fast that even light is asking for its autograph. Now, I'm not saying it's a rocket with style, but it maneuvers through the skies like it's dodging awkward conversations at a party. With a nuclear payload, it's the ultimate travel package, just make sure you pack your lead line suitcase. Stay tuned as we navigate through the Avangard's strategic dance moves, making missile defense systems question their life choices. I'm Danny, your guide through the hypersonic roller coaster, let's explore the skies and beyond. The Avangard is a revolutionary hypersonic glide vehicle designed by Russia, transforming cruise missile capabilities. Here's a concise overview, hypersonic speed, Avangard can reach speeds up to Mach 27, making it extremely fast and difficult to intercept. Maneuverability, its ability to perform sharp maneuvers during flight enhances its evasiveness, making it a formidable challenge for anti-missile systems. Nuclear payload, Avangard carries a nuclear warhead, enabling it to deliver a devastating payload. Strategic importance, the Avangard's speed and unpredictability significantly raise the bar for missile defense, offering Russia a strategic advantage. The Avangard represents a paradigm shift in cruise missile technology, emphasizing speed and agility too. The Avangard weighs about 2,000 kilograms, but don't let its size fool you. It travels at an astonishing speed ranging from Mach 20 to Mach 27. That's faster than the speed of sound. What sets the Avangard apart is its incredible kinetic energy. With the speed it travels at, it generates the equivalent of an astounding 21 tons of TNT. Just imagine the impact that this missile can deliver. But how does it accomplish such incredible feats? The Avangard glides through the atmosphere, making it much more difficult for air defense systems to detect and intercept. Its hypersonic speed and unpredictable flight path make it a remarkable force to be reckoned with. The Avangard also boasts an advanced maneuvering capability that allows it to evade enemy missiles, ensuring its successful delivery of a devastating payload. This missile is truly a technological marvel, a game-changer in the world of cruise missiles. With its cutting-edge design and unprecedented speed, the Avangard is revolutionizing modern warfare. It possesses the ability to strike swiftly and with incredible precision, making it a force to be feared. In conclusion, the Avangard cruise missile is undeniably the kinetic powerhouse that is redefining the capabilities of cruise missiles. Its speed, maneuverability, and destructive kinetic energy are unmatched. The age of cruise missiles has truly reached new heights. The Avangard, previously known as U-71 and U-74, underwent flight testing from February 2015 to June 2016. These tests were conducted using UR-100 UTTKH ICBMs launched from Domborovsky Air Base in Orenburg Oblast. During the tests, the Avangard achieved a speed of 11,200 km per hour, 7,000 miles per hour, 3,100 meters per second, and effectively struck targets at the Kara missile test range in Kamchak Accra. In 2018, Vladimir Putin announced that testing of the Avangard was complete and it had entered serial production. The Avangard has been demonstrated to a U.S. inspection group in accordance with the New START Treaty on November 24 to 26, 2019. On December 27, 2019, the 1st Missile Regiment armed with the Avangard officially entered combat duty. The Avangard is a pure glide vehicle without an independent propulsion system and can perform evasive maneuvers, making it invulnerable to any missile defense system. It has a blast yield of more than 2 megatons TNT and weighs about 2,000 kilograms, traveling at Mach 20 to 27. The strategic rocket forces of Russia are the only operator of the Avangard, with deployments in the 13th Red Banner Rocket Division at Yasny, Orenburg Oblast. On March 1, 2018, Russian President Vladimir Putin in his presidential address to the Federal Assembly in Moscow announced that testing of the weapon is now complete and that it has entered serial production. 15. This was further confirmed by the commander of the Strategic Rocket Forces, Colonel General Sergei Karaveyev. Thanks for watching our video. If you found this information intriguing, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more fascinating content. Stay tuned for our next video.